I mean, he was. He, I think he's also the one who died, and the doctors were like befuddled by the amount of meat in his colon. <laughs> like, they're like, it's, it's wild that he still he lived that long. <laughs> like, <laughs> yeah, that's where the whole red meat. How much red meat do you end up getting in your colon um, over a lifetime uh, came from? Is that John Wayne? They were just like, oh my god, this guy. Like his whole intestine was like a stuffed sausage casing. <laughs> uh, but it would have been kind of nice to like what? be um, smoking all that and eating all the steaks you want. No greens, oh, no yeah, vegetables. Yeah. Who has and, the worst colon in Hollywood now? Vin oh. Diesel, maybe? Oh, Is he God. fat now? I don't think yeah, he's Yeah, Vin fat. Diesel put on a Vin few Diesel. pounds. Whoa. Vin Diesel. The Rock. <laughs> <laughs> the Rock is a, he's a specimen. They would have to. It would have to be an older star. And they just, you know what? They did live the life back then, man. They drank and smoked and ate like crap. And they just, they looked every part of it too, man. Some of those guys, <laughs> I love watching shows like The Twilight Zone. You see somebody on there and it's Rod Serling's talking about it. And he goes, this is uh, Mark uh, Harris. He's a 25-year-old <laughs> businessman. And you're looking like, the guy's got the horseshoe balding. And he's just fucking, the guy's like, this guy's 55. Yeah. He's like, 20, to a 20, this young couple yeah. lost their way. It's like, the woman looks like my grandma. Uh, yeah, they just, you know, ridden hard and put up wet in the, uh, uh, the horse like, business. As they're like, nowadays... Like if they smoke cigarettes during a scene, apparently they're smoking like fake pretend ones. Back oh, then, yeah, yeah, yeah. they're like taking breaks from their cigarette scenes to be like, "I'm gonna smoke a real one, like at, at my leisure." Cigarette. And so, yeah, that's right, if you're thinking right. like the worst colon in Hollywood now. It's an odd year, so Jonah Hill's probably fat again. So I would say, oh, uh, <laughs> poor Jonah Hill, he got yeah. he got fit looking and uh, like muscular. And then I think I found out that was a Photoshop. But uh, oh, no, yeah. he definitely got it. He got into Brazilian Jiu Jitsu and got into shape and he started lifting. And it's, oh, well, then good. I think, yeah, so. no, he, he definitely into, turned he it just around. He posted something, he posted something on social media that he was asking people to not talk to him about his weight. Like, don't, yeah. don't even come up to him and say, Wow, you look good, man. Hey, you lost weight, you look great. Like, he doesn't want anyone acknowledging it because it, it makes him feel weird. He doesn't want to talk about it. Um, yeah, so I, I kind of get it. I, yeah. I, I, I might be misreading your vibe, like, like he's being oversensitive, but oh my goodness, no, no, I, you know, it's are, him. that's how he feels, so he's like entitled 200 to yeah. million people who have an opinion on how you look, and mm -hmm. it's somehow Jonah Hill more than other people, like, <laughs> yeah, yeah, you know, I think uh, anybody that put on uh, that was heavy and then lost a lot of weight, uh, Adele, she's going through all that crap now where people. Are actually the other way. Where you get they're it, angry like, at. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. The, the Adele but shit is crazy. Like where she, I think she posted something. I obviously don't really follow her career, but she's been heavy and for a long time. And yeah. she was like pleased with her progress of hard work and dieting yeah. and like, look, I'm I'm getting skinny. I'm getting healthy. And all of her like fat women followers are like, yes! you betrayed us. <laughs> You've left for the dark side. You were healthy before. She's like, well, I wasn't feeling good, it? and I was I wasn't in a good mood. My hormones. Were probably off you you bitch you they were, were calling her yeah they were saying that she was body shaming mm -hmm. heavy people because she was talking about how good she felt now that she's lost weight and how how proud she is and how she feels like she wants to be photographed now and go out mm -hmm. and they took everything she said not as a positive for someone that's accomplished <laughs> something but as you piece of shit you're <laughs> bashing me i mean how do you rationalize and that? Like, like, uh, they the made her the thing? Uncle Tom of fat women. Yeah. Like, and she won't be the last. Some other celebrity oh. will lose weight because they're not feeling good. They'll start to feel better. They'll post about it. Yep. And they'll get. And it's like, this doesn't happen about anything else. It's only f losing weight. Like any celebrity yeah. is like, I was really, I was drinking from sun up to sundown. I, I didn't know who I was <laughs> half the day, but I'm over it. I'm three months clean. He holds his chip and a bunch of like badly typed comments. He's like, you fuck you, pussy. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Robert yeah, I just Downey keep Jr. drinking. used to have, I, I don't know Pain, what his substance right? abuse of, of choice was, but he had trouble and he got in court trouble all the time. You don't see the people who are drug doing drugs now be like you you abandoned us yeah yeah, yeah. <laughs> never happened <laughs> he was cooler when he was doing cocaine all day <laughs>